I think it was easier to be married 100 years ago because guys died at 48. <laughs> when the priest said, till death do you part, the guy's like, shit, I could do that. <laughs> I'm almost dead now, I got an abscess tooth. There's a plague in Europe, yeah, I'll take that deal. Even if you survived longer back in the day, it was still easier because, she, you know, she looked hot by candlelight. <laughs> That's the key to a long marriage, low lighting. <laughs> no more than a 40 watt bulb in the house, don't get crazy. <laughs> Forget the 60 watt, 40 watt, max. Dimmer switches, you're just trying to catch a glimpse of each other at this point. <laughs> That's why they invented the three-way bulb. <laughs> to gradually prepare you for what your spouse actually looks like. <laughs> click, click, oh shit, baby, dial the click back, just one notch. One. <laughs> so many divorces in the 80s because of track lighting. <laughs> Three 100 watt bulbs focusing on everything that's wrong in your marriage. <laughs> it would be easier 100 years ago to have children. We screwed up, we spoiled them. We created child labor laws. <laughs> How stupid is that? Now they're 25, they live at home, no job. Back in the day, they were nine, bringing home a check. <laughs> you wanna pass that up? There was no attitude back then, like today, where they go, Daddy, this isn't caramel macchiato. <laughs> you never heard that because they were inside of a chimney sweeping. <laughs> Can I come out, Papa? No, you had 11 more hours on your shift. <laughs> <laughs> 